Hi, we doing, everybody. Hola. Welcome to another episode of Getting Jiggy With It. I'm Will. I'm Audrey. And today we're playing Squire for Hire, or as I like to call it, Hire for Squire. And what's funny is the, the creator of the game says now he can't stop calling it that. <laughs> so he left a comment on Board Game Geek about that. Uh, but for those of you that did not watch our previous two videos, one, Squire for Hire. Squire for Hire is a tabular building game where you are trying to fill your bag with loot and goodies to prove to the hero that you are the best squire. You're the one they want to hire. So, squire for hire. There you go. So, uh, previously we played the main core pack and we played the expansion. This is the um, add-on pack, which is called the squire pack numero uno. And what this gives you is additional squires that you can play as. So you can see we have much, much more uh, squires. Each one, of course, gives more variability, more uh, ways to play, a little bit of diversity in the game. The second thing is, uh, in this pack, it gives you a new game mode. So now this new game mode, of course, can be played as long as you own both expansions, uh, basically the core pack and the Mystic Runes expansion. But, you know, having extra squires is not a bad thing either. So what ends up happening is when you want to play this a new mode is you will shuffle both decks together. So you notice we have a lot bigger deck. That means your game play time is going to increase ever so slightly. And then you get to choose two squires, basically one from each uh, of the different expansions. Of course, we are playing all of the ones that came in the Squire Pack 2. And you'll choose which one do you want to be your main squire and I'm kind of off to the side there, and then which you want to be your secondary squire. So your main squire will go on top, your secondary squire will go underneath. So I'm playing Asha, uh, which is the studying scholar. So she comes with, or he comes with, I don't know, I don't know if Asha is a boy or a girl. I'm gonna say she. She comes with one magic, and then glasses are worth additional points uh, when next to a magic item. And then she likes daggers and books. She likes coins and magical orbs. And then because I have the bonus of uh, Emori, then I get a bonus if I can also do um, the little stabby weapon and the flail. I believe those are called flails. I forget what the little stabby weapons are called. Uh, but that's what I get there. And then Audrey is playing the Bonita. It's Bonita Emi. Emi. Uh, she likes the, um, what is this one? The, the oh, she has one. She gets one, one. Oh, she has one. One right? weapon. And she likes the bow and the uh, coins and the metal hat. Armor. Yeah, the metal armor hat. Hat, right. Yeah. And the, well, the magic wand. Magic, I don't know what that is. It's a, like a magic staff. That's like, that one's the longer one. That's the staff. Oh, the yeah, and then so and yeah, and so then you get a bonus with feathers. Feathers are worth zero uh, or two when next to a bow. All right, so you want to basically uh, try to get those combined together. Hey, Zinchurion X Y Z, how you doing over there on the Twitch? Ooh. So we're playing a card game. It, I know it doesn't look like Pokemon. It doesn't look like Yu-Gi-Oh. Although somebody did want us to play Yu-Gi-Oh. So Zin, I might need you to tell me. Like, what are two good Yu-Gi-Oh theme decks to buy? And then you might have to teach me how to play. <laughs> hey, Game Direction over on the Twitch as well. Or maybe he's saying hi to, <laughs> hi to Zen. All right. So with that said, we need to figure out who goes first. Of course, the way we decide who goes first is our Extra Life D20. So, of course, we do support Extra Life Charities, which goes towards Children Miracle Network. Uh, the kids in need need our help. So every dollar does help. If you can't help, of course, always go over to our Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook and just share those posts. We always have a pinned post that you can retweet or share to get the word out. And maybe if you can't donate a dollar, maybe one of your friends can, right? Because uh, that's how we're going to help these kids during this tough time that we're going through right now because they are more susceptible than a lot of us are. I don't even know if they if they're getting the vaccines or anything because most of them are going to be really young. I mean, the right, vaccine, and you know, it's over twelve. Now. Yeah, it's is it twelve now? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So uh, definitely go out there and support the kids. Uh, so the way we do this is it's supposed to be whoever packed a bag last. That's how you normally play, but we always use our D twenty. 
So highs or lows, even or odds? What do you want? Evens. Evens. Even Stevens, and it is odd. We have had really bad luck today. You've had really that. bad rolls today. All right. So with that said, I draw my two cards, and then you draw your two cards. Um, which one? Okay, so I want this one. That is my first card. And then here's my second card. So, of course, I have to completely add something to... Oh, I got a flail. I like the flail. Dang it, but I want to cover up my glasses. Uh, oh, I need coins. This is useless. <laughs> That's okay. um, oh, and it's next to... Oh, next to a magic item. Any magic item. Ooh. Gracias, mi amor. That was muy helpful. Muy, muy. All right. So we need to put out our treasure cards for our adventure. All right. There we go. First step. I uh, don't have a clue how to play. <laughs> you just like the shiny cards. <laughs> yeah, somebody said Yu-Gi-Oh. I'm like, oh, those are about as hard to get as Pokemon cards right now. Uh, the theme decks aren't. I mean, we do have some two Pokemon theme decks that uh, we have to play. We got the uh, B-Battle and then we got the uh, Inteleon that we're going to have to play. Oh, hang on. Yeah. All right. But back to our wonderful adventure. So encounter. Uh, the local temple has offered to provide some provisions in exchange for a donation. So I have to cover up one valuable in order to take a prize. I need coins. But I want any of those prizes. I could use that dagger though. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do it. I'm losing I'm losing a point by covering this up, or possible two points, but I'm going to gain um, a bonus point. So I'm going to go ahead and take that, and I'm going to cover up the coins. All right, back to you. So this one is my quest, see? See, that's your quest. The cold of the mountains chills Chills you to the bone. Wear some extra gear or burn a magic item to stay warm. So I have to have, have two. two. And you have oh, three. Oh, yeah. Your cloak is worth three. So that quest is complete. Which item do you want? I want. You want. This one. That's one. All right. So. <laughs> I want that one, but I don't know where I want to put it. I <laughs> just know that I need. Did I do this right first? Yeah, it was yeah, right there, probably. yeah. Um, uh, now remember, these are the uh, rune stones. So that's morph. This counts as uh, anything at the end of the game. Oh, yeah, so yeah, So it counts yeah, as yeah. One, one of anything. So while you're figuring that out, so a... Oh, man, okay, that's fine. A path full of jagged, rocky obstacles lies ahead. You can turn back or take your chances with the armor to advance through the dangerous rocks and ice. I have to lose one armor... Um, let's see. I need, I need stabby thing. Where's my stabby thing? I don't have a stabby thing. But I'd have to get rid of this. So I'd have to put something on top of that. And there's nothing. Uh, and that's going to give me minus two to cover that up. Well, I like glasses, which is down here, which I'm getting bonus points on. That would only make me have to take one, but I can't get the full thing. Oh, I can. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Um, so I'm going to do this one. I'm going to do it there. I might have to move mine too. I think. I think I'm too close to you, or yes. you're too. Cl yeah, oh no! Close. Actually, you should be like right about here-ish. I think. I don't think I have this quite centered. Is the is the issue? There we go. Let's slide all that over. There you go. And then we they can maybe. I guess they don't have to see our, our characters. Alright, where are you going? Oh, you're going to a quest. Going to a questing we will go. A questing we will go. I don't know. <laughs> you haven't you have contracted a deadly blight. <laughs> Get away from me. Dirge? Uh Dirge, oh, that's the guy's name. Oh. The local alchemist, see, will sell you the cure for a price. So two gold. Which you have. Oh, yeah. So you're good to go. All right, so which one do you want? 
Uh, oh, you need those, don't you? Yeah. Uh, next to what? Your bow? No, next to the magic stuff. Oh, wow. Magic thingy. You don't have to cover anything up. Well, unless you want to cover that up. See, because that's trash. Oh, you okay, you were covering it all up that way. Okay. Well, I don't know, because then maybe I cover, I cannot... Add something I would have to, to that. I have to cover this. Well, I was saying you were going to cover at least one trash, like that way. Yeah, because you have no feather. Okay, um, so I am going into a dungeon. Uh, dungeon, your party ventures into an ancient stone castle in search of loot, but are greeted by a barrage of magical traps instead. So I either need three armor, which I have. I got four armor. Um, so I can pick a prize. I need some more glasses is what I need. I need feathers. I, have I need more glasses or I need more books. I don't need any of that stuff. All right, so this is three with one. That's two. So this gives me the most bang for my buck. So I think I'm going to do it here because then that covers up that feather. Okay. Back to you. Dungeon. Dungeon. Your party must defeat a person, Dark Queen. There you go. To take its horde of loot. The raven-like creature may be distracted by throwing coins to catch its eye. So three, three weapons. weapons I have. Yeah, more, yeah, you have more than enough weapons. Um, yeah, these ones aren't the bad ones. It's those encounters that are that are annoying. So I have an encounter for me. So what do I do? So you get to pick a loot. Oh, so same. Um, yeah, I think you're in the same boat. I don't think either of those help you. So yeah. basically, this one you would get. This one you would get three, but you lose two. That one you get two, but you lose one. Well, I'm just hoping I get a feather. Maybe this one will be better. Well, it's easier to place too because you only have to put it on one piece. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute, there was one that already had these two beside each other? That's like yes. cheating! <laughs> Well, that was your first card too, wasn't it? Yeah. That's, that's, like, one that's like cheating. Oh, okay, that's smart. Covering covering that one up. Well yeah, but remember you can use that for anything, so most likely you're probably gonna use it for a bow, oh, I figure. Oh, it's a book. I can use books, because I have another dagger up here. What do I have to get rid of though to use that book? Oh, I gotta get rid of a Dang it. I don't have a magic item near that other dagger. I have a magic item near this dagger, but it's already near a book. All right, you find an elderly seer who can tell your fortune. However, to activate their powers of foresight, uh, they must draw powers from your magical item. So I have to lose a magical item. I want that book, but I, there's nowhere that I can put that book. See, because I need another magical item down here to connect to those glasses. Oh, I had this one here. Did I, but this was here when I placed this one. Well, you are so, so not thinking. I should have put, actually, could I put that any other way to where this would have touched that? I could have covered up the gold. Because mm -hmm. the gold only counts as one point. That would have given me, at yeah, one point, <laughs> it would have been a wash. Oh, I want that book, but I don't want that book right now. Because I can't get rid of a magical item. So, yeah, since I can't get rid of a magical item... Yeah, because there's no way I can cover that one up. There's no way I can cover that one up. Yeah. I can't complete that encounter. Dungeon. 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 I cannot say this word. Dungeon? Dungeon. A dangerous... A dangerous lich awakens while you attempt to loot their crypt. Try to defeat the powerful being or survive long enough to escape. Three weapons, which you have more than enough weapons. So you can pick either one. Thank you. Well, so this remember this is the well this is the under over, yeah. So that's gonna let you place anything over or under. Also has that stabby thing that I kinda need. Die! You can't take both cards. <laughs> that's my stabby thing. Okay. Oh, 
I need to exact. But same you can't thing. you can't place it under over on the uh, activation. I don't think. Place place new loot activation. cards under. You cannot use an item to complete a story card this way. So I cannot go under right now. I can just put something over it. It's, yeah, cause it says new loot cards, and that's oh, the so loot I card. I cannot do this. I cannot do this. Well, why would you want to cover up your room? This. Oh. So I have these two next to each other. The high room gives... allows you to place new loot cards under existing cards in your bag, as long as one item from the top card fully fits in the card you top. You cannot use an item to complete a story card this way. But well, you're not completing the story card. It is a new loot card, but it's a new loot card because it has it on it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. That's probably something we would have to go into Board Game Geek and, and figure out. To me, I feel like you can't do that yet because you don't have the room to do it. Oh, but look, I can do this. I just lose okay. one item here. Okay, that works. Yeah, because I'll give you plus one anyways. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, then which one do you want to cover up? I'm guessing, well, the thing is, you need this one because it's got the helmet, but I need it because it's got the book. Neither one of us need that one, so. But I can't get it now. No, 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 you already picked, you picked the one. No, you gotta figure out where do you want this, which side. Oh, I'm covering. You're covering, see, see, see. Now, remember, this one, actually, you can use too, because, oh, no, it won't, you won't be able to fully get it on there. Well, you would, but you'd have to cover up like that. Be nice to you. You can be nice to me. Although that gave you something you needed anyway, so it doesn't matter. Alright, quest. Quest time. A group of bandits have trapped you in a nearby cave and demand you tell them uh to <laughs> demand a toll to let you go free. <laughs> so I need two. I got plenty of weapons. If I can get to me book. And I'm going to put me book. A key. For extra points. Oh, more glasses. Mas Antiochus. Quest. Spirits plague the local mountain village of Half, Half Wind. Cast a powerful spell or leave an offering to lay them to rest. So you need two, two magic, magic and you got have. four. So you're good to go. Alright. So. You're gonna get your staff. Do you have the cloth hat yet? What? Oh, yeah, you do. We already have a staff on it. Okay. Although you do have this one over here, remember, because you can make that anything. Uh, but I don't know. Would you we be don't able know any uh, I don't think you'd be able to line it up, would you? If I get this? Yeah, I don't think you can line it up to make it touch that thing. Mm. You could, but you'd have to cover up all of that. Well, it's worth two points, though. Oh, no, because I can put it under with the... Yes, with the... you can do under as well. All right. I'll give you just the glasses. Oh, you're going to give me glasses. Wow, that only helps me if I can put... It... I can't put an extra magical item, so <laughs> the glasses aren't going to do you much good. Mm. Oh, they're already beside a magical item. Oh, well, no. Remember, you can cover it up. You still have to choose where you're going to put that, because we're one card ahead. That, that wasn't very nice, by the way. <laughs> Ah, te amo. <laughs> Encounter. A magical barrier seals off a hidden tomb. You may be able to dispel it by destroying one of your magical items. Um, and I have no magical items within destroyable range, or at least not that I want to destroy. Right? Um, Can I do this? Okay. Oh, is that yeah. too much? No, that, that fits. <laughs> See, like I put all underneath. I wouldn't have done all, no. I would have done... Because earth, it's I trash. Would, I know, but I would have done all that. Like That's what I would have done. That's what I was thinking you were going to do, because see, then you kept that out as an extra point yeah, and got yeah, rid of yeah, what was under there. All right, so I can't accomplish this, or I don't want to, so I'm just going to cover up that wonderful thing that you needed. You've done it to me twice, so it's only, it's only fair. It's only fair I did it back. For some reason, I feel like we're crooked. My OCD on the camera, and I, because I, I, I don't know if it's a camera or if it's us. Both. We're crooked. 
We're crooked. <laughs> Your weapons are rusty and worn. Sander, a nearby blacksmith, can repair them for a cost. Two gold. Two gold. So you have two oh, gold, right? Gold. You have mucho gold. Alright, which one do you want? You don't either, huh? Well, no coins, I need. You still haven't found a single feather, have you? No. Hmm. Last time you did. See, that was the good gameplay. I think I still won, but... If I put these coins next to this, will it still count? Um, I could. I think it's got to be unique. I think it has to be unique combinations. Mm. I don't remember the rules specifically saying one way or the other, but to me it, it makes sense that it's got to be unique. Because it's got to be a pair, right? Choose the wrong one because this is too big and I don't know what to put to. Remember, you can go under. Every time? All the time. As long as you can fit one whole item underneath, as long as you can cover one full item, you're good. So, considering those are only like one items, you know. And can I go just under one? Like if I wanted to do this? Yeah. Well, you don't want to cover up your yeah. part of your axe handle. Or... Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't specifically say, but I'm, I'm going with, yeah, it's got to be an actual thing. Uh, Alex, I used to play Game direct, uh, Game Direction says, I used to play Yu-Gi-Oh, but prefer pre-built decks for Pokemon. But you're right, it's really hard to find that ma magic terrifies me. Well, that's the same thing. Magic just came out with a whole line of new theme decks. And same thing, I was thinking, let's just get it so we can play something for different content, right? Just some kind of thing to show people different things. But it it's like, I would have been fine if there was only two decks that come out. But my completionist mentality, I would have wanted to get all of the new Magic theme decks to play and show. Also, being a content creator kind of hurts that as well, right? You, you want to show all the decks. So we just didn't do it. Although I think there is two Yu-Gi-Oh decks coming out. Uh, I saw somebody offering a combo pack on Amazon. Does this work? No, you covered up part of your shield. No, that, that you'd have to cover it up completely. Even if I put that in Yeah, there, everything has to be covered or uncovered. That's what I said. Don't put it all the way under there. Just put it, put it like that. I mean, yeah, you're not covering that up, which is what you're trying to do. But yeah, that's fine. All right, which one do you want to cover? I know you don't want to cover up your hat, do you? Mm. <laughs> Oh, that's a magical item, and that, that void thing's kind of helpful. Uh, encounter. Card. You dropped your hero's weapon in the chasm. Leave the weapon behind and carry on to the dungeon's treasures, or turn back to retrieve it. So, I have to lose a weapon, and I don't... That means i got to lose that whole thing. That's a lot. I don't want to lose that. don't want to lose that. That is a bonus for me. So, I would have to lose... Three weapons, which is still only worth one point, so I'm not losing that much. But am I going to get any bonus for doing that? So I have a magical item. Which I need next to this pair of glasses. What are the cards for? Well, no, it would end up here. I was like, if I cover that up, would it touch the glasses? It wouldn't. Mm -hmm. Um, where'd the magical orb go? Is it one of these still? Oh, it is. It's it's like two down, isn't it? See, I don't remember. Yeah, I think it's two down. Although we do have this. Although that it's that would only well that would only do me good down here. Basically. Yeah, it basically makes the junk zero. No, I, I, I don't I don't see a reason to pick up any of those cards. I mean, I would get rid of one. I'd lose one point. And I'd put this, I would get one, two, three, I'd lose two, so I'd be getting one point. One, two, three, I'd be losing two. So I'd be trading one for one. No, that's not worth it. Okay. Hey, Louis Jinx, thanks for the subscription over there on the YouTubes. Quest. Quest. Your party prepares for a deadly quest to drive out an invading mountain dragon. You will need to 
bring as many weapons or armor as you can muster. Okay, so you need either four, four or four, which you've got plenty of armor. You got plenty of weapons too, so you're good. I still gotta figure out, like, I forgot to check. I, I forgot to do that today. The, the little notifications aren't coming up. The subscription and, and follower notifications don't come up. Gotta fix that. It doesn't go no 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 no. What do you need? Oh, that needs to be next to a bow. I ha I have not receiving any bow. You have a bow. Only one, but that's that has a. No, bow. but it, the other things can be touching it. You just two coins w wouldn't count as oh, double. Okay. So you can put the the hood to touch it. That's whether or not you want to lose everything or cover everything up, I guess. Uh, I can also go under. Yeah, you can always go under. So you just have to, you basically can put it under that way. That, basically, you're losing the whole card. Oh, no, no. Um, find a way to re, where you're covering one item up and it's still touching. Um, is, there, is there something right here? No. No, no, no. But it cannot, it cannot hide no. the trash either. Yeah. You have to cover. You have to cover everything up. Oh, well, the I other, still the have other to side. Cover? The other side. One item has to One be completely item covered. Has to be covered. Oh, but <laughs> keep going. I lost the coins. Okay. Well, I mean, yeah, I mean, it's unless you can. The other way is you slide the whole thing. I mean, if you're gonna lose the coins anyways, then yeah, you'd rather just slide the whole thing under. You don't lose the coins. You'd rather just do this. <laughs> Lose the trash as well. Yeah, you lose the trash as well. Yeah. All right, where do you want that one? Those are the same two I had last time, but I think you took what I put down. The other way would be more helpful, boy, for boy. <laughs> oh, why do I get all the encounters? I've no, I've gotten almost every encounter, haven't I? All right, you come across a wounded traveler. He agrees to give you precious loot if you give him a healing potion. So I do have a healing potion. What was that thing? The mim that's the mimic, right? Oh yeah, that's the mimic. The what? The mimic. I need it here. Oh man, I need it. I need it on top of this. I don't think there's a way for me to get it on top of that because I need to be like that. I don't know if there's a card I want. I'm, I'm just, just sorry. No, I have to get rid of a potion. That's my encounter. I mean, it's fine. I mean, I've got a mimic, which means maybe I can get something later. I was going to mimic it off that because it's worth two points. I don't have any coins, so I can't mimic potion. That's fine. I'm going to keep the mimic because the mimic is really powerful. I just hope I get something to go with it. Um, oh, they're about the same, aren't they? Mm. Yeah, they're, they're identical. So you get the same number of points no matter what. Oh! <laughs> well, no, you can't take it yet! I know you can but take it, it because, because you, yeah. yeah, you complete the uh, yeah, task. Yeah, how much magic. Your party ventures into a powerful sorcerer's... Well, sorcerer's, there. yeah. So, their illusions can lead you to can lead you into dangerous traps unless you have the magic to protect yourself. I do have the magic to you protect yourself. You do have the magic. Side. All right, take your bow. Mm, so I need you next to anything, pretty much. This one. This. Well, no, you already have something next to that. You already have one next to that helmet. You have the coins down at the bottom. Yeah, right there in that corner. Look. Down here. Let's see. Why am I helping you? Because you love <laughs> because me, so. me so much. All right, where, which one do you want to cover? Left, uh, left Twix or right Twix? Left. It's helpful for me either. I don't need the big dagger. I need little daggers. Yeah. Uh, funding is needed to pay for a group of mercenaries to protect the town from an invading skeleton army. Show you have the funds or pay them the deposit now. All right, so I got plenty of gold. Um, so that one is worth one. This one is worth 
one, but I get that junk removal thing. The junk talisman. Is there any junk that I can I would want to remove? Not really. Um This one. I don't know why. Oh, hang on. Oh, I can't touch. Dang it. I have another shield there, but I can't. I was hoping I'd get it in there further. Like, if I had the under under thing like you did. Mm. Oh, no, I couldn't because, yeah, I wouldn't be able to get it under this one. Oh, that was bad. I can't I can't do it off that one either. Mm -hmm. <laughs> don't hold me. I'm actually saying, um, um, is this a genuine hole? I know, and I can't do under, so like I couldn't slide it all. Oh. <laughs> oh. And then none of this is magical items. That's the magical item, although it wouldn't help me. Either. Let's try to get next to the glasses. Um. Then you can get rid of the armor. The. Yeah. On the trash. Yeah. This keeps four for four. That gives me a bonus point. I guess that's what I'll do. Alright. Um, cover up that one. Oh, a feather. I'm just handing you guards. I'm just handing you guards. Dungeon. You're Dungeon. Alright. Dungeon. I cannot Dun say. Dungeon. Hmm. Yeah. Your party There you go. Is approached is approached by a traveling sales world. They warn of the dangers ahead and offer to join your party in exchange for some coin or a weapon to fight with. Alright, so you need three gold, which you have. Much of you are. And at a certain point you're almost guaranteed to have everything you need. Yeah. All right. So I need the next two bottles. Where? Oh, here. Or there, but do you really want to cover? Oh, uh, oh, I thought it was on a corner. Yeah, you're right. You have to strategically put it somewhere. Yep. No, that works. Like this? Yeah, that's fine. You can't even see yours anymore. I, I, there's no way we're sliding it up. Sorry, guys, you can't see the bottom of our thing. There's no way we're sliding it up now. Which one do you want to cover? Mm. All right. Dungeon. Your party comes across some ruins filled with swirling blades, or swinging blades. I guess they could be swirling blades, too. Uh, wear your best protective gear or use your weapon to jam the traps. So you need three. I have four. Two. I guess I will take this magical staff and put it next to this other magical staff. Alright, so dungeon. You encounter a group of monks talking. Taking. Taking. <laughs> shelter from a blizzard in an ancient temple. Offer them some armor or a cost a spell. Or cast a spell to calm the winds outside. Alright, so three magic, which you have. Alright. Um, Do you have anything you can match, matchy matchy? Oh, you matchy matchy that coin. But right. the coin goes with the bow. Well, oh, not the coin, I'm sorry, the ring. The ring? Yeah, the one ring. Oh. Lord of the Rings, you know, the one ring. The ring of power. That's it. What do you want? I see the same in every card. I, because we keep pulling one off the one side because that's the better one. Neither one of us want either of those two, so they just stay. Oh, gracias. Well, I have to lose one armor again. All right. Uh, any noise will alert the guards to your attempts to steal the goods. Drop the armor that clings inside your bag to avoid detection. So I have to lose one armor, which that's four. I mean, I guess I don't mind losing the four. Can I combine that with anything to make it worthwhile? Not really. 
Uh, I can't cover that whole thing up. One, two, three. Yeah, because I would just stop there. Although I could... Ah, still works. Okay. Yeah, it works. Uh, I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to cover up this armor. And then put that there. So then that gives me... Next to the Mimic I was trying to do earlier. Oh, another feather. And that one is on the corner. <laughs> oh. oh, but I don't... I don't have... Oh, I have this corner. Oh, and you, it would be better, like, when I post those out, it'd be better if you got an encounter, because then you'd be forced to cover something up, and it wouldn't necessarily benefit you. But no, i got to give you all the quests and the easy stuff. Your party <laughs> has been hired by the Mainland Museum to bring back rare magical artifacts or valuable treasures for their collection. So, four of either, and you've got more than enough. I guess you're going to take your uh, feather. Uh, all right. But I needed that orb of globe magic magicalness. That's worth two points if I put an extra coin. I don't even have any coins. How do I have no? You have all the coins. You do. I think you have all the coins. <laughs> all right. One there. One there. And, of course, I'm going to get the encounter. All right, so we probably read all these now, so we don't have to read them anymore. So we have armor. I get minus one armor to get... Oh, we do have the orb of niceness, but I don't have any coins to go with it. Oh, it does have glasses, though. That's Oh, that's the orb with the glasses next to it. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it. Uh, there we go. That has my glasses. All right. So I need to have for magic, I do. Alright. Oh, uh, so I'm going to get... <laughs> it's our same card. <laughs> well, first it's going to be the same card, we just mixed them up. This is the one I wanted, though, out of what was left. This one was buried at the bottom. But you have to take one first, anymore. Unless you decide you don't want to complete your quest. Alright. All right, so quest, I need two, which, of course, I have two. Ooh, 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 juicy. Oh, I, I always have to cover one item completely. Or go under. Yes, or go under completely. Oh, you got to be kidding me. I finally get the one I need, and I can't. Like, if I could do the... All right, what gives me more points? That gives me, oh, this gives me two. Okay, so I want to do that. All right, so here is yours. So you have to cover one armor to play that card. The first encounter I have. I know. But okay, again, that's your choice. Cover an armor to take that card or not. Now, you can use this. Yeah, you want that to be next to... One of, next to that one there, which you could cover in armor, but you're right, not going to get it to touch. One. Oh, that's right. You're using the wild. You don't have another one? No. You don't want it. You can choose not to do it. No. no. Um, so for me, I need two gold, which I have. So I put it there to mimic that. I don't have another one of those. I put things under now, though. Uh, magical, oh, that's hard to touch in. I have another, no, I don't have another axe. All right, so there's, there's nothing I can do, so I'm just gonna cover that up. Right. That is your freebie, you can put it wherever you want. Remember the void voids out things? So if you get some. Yeah, I put that one there. Mm, I don't think you're going to get close enough to make any of the other ones get voided out. So... But there's two on that mat. You sure want to go that way? Because you're voiding out one and but... you're losing an extra point by burying that other one. 
about here? By the way. Slide the bones under here. Is that too far? No. Oh, that's one too high. Yeah, that's one too high. Oh, blue sleeves. Yeah. I think no matter what, yeah, you end up losing. What about here? Um. No. <laughs> what about here? Okay. Hey, if I hide the bones. Yeah. Yep, and then that voids that one out. All right, that is all the cards. Time for points. And we remembered our dry erase marker this time. All right, so one point for each weapon. So if you want to count yours, I'll count mine. Or each item. Well, item and move, don't forget your moves. Go see him, Yeah. Go see him, All right, I'll just go on. I'll go on to my next one. All right, so now we need an identical mm -hmm. um, Glasses are more than one, two, mm -hmm. Magic. That's my next two coins. I like. Minus. Minus junk. All right. Oh, identical items. Yeah. All right. And then um, X points. So how many feathers next to bows? So, so four. It's not gonna be the whole thing. So it's four plus um, bow connected to um, Coins, coins, so one, two, two, so that's six. And then bow next to heavy metal, just one. That's another coins. two. Yeah, to so the heavy helmet, yeah. Six, so, yeah. Six, mm -hmm. seven, eight, ocho. Oh, okay. That one's worth two. And your last one is soft helmet next to staff. So one, one two. two. So that's another four. Holy cow, you you tore me up. Um, and then your junk. Oh, junk. Oh, oh. Lot. Well, this one's voided. That one's voided. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. ten. So minus ten. So just. So, mm -hmm. I have an odd feeling I already beat me. Shh. <laughs> Four, seven. With your minus 10? Oh, 33. Yeah, so I only got 30. I already kicked my booty. Oh, that much because <sighs> I got double the Squire card. Points these two, on, these two basically the... canceled each other out. My, my so, six yeah. points. I only get one point for each glasses. So I only got one, two, right? Uh, okay, 33 plus 12, 45. Plus two, 47. Okay? 33 I plus- I did it wrong, it's 37. Okay. Thir 33 plus four, 37. Yeah, because 10 minus 12 is two. So two and two and 33 is 37. Either way, you still beat me by seven points. It wasn't as bad of a trouncing as I thought. <laughs> All right, so there we go, guys. That is 
Squire for Hire, the Squire Pack Numero Uno. So considering this is Numero Uno, I'd imagine they will most likely have additional ones. Um, so of course, uh, if you want to pick this game up, of course, we always have links down below uh, for Amazon. You can also go out to uh, Letterman Games. However, the whole reason we were playing this this week, of course, is Letterman Games does have Adventure Tactics up on Kickstarter right now. So if you want to participate or get or buy or pledge or bet all those things that you do on Kickstarter, head on over to the link that we will have down in the show description. Uh, if you like this type of content, want to watch more live gameplay, because that's the only way we do gameplays normally, make sure you hit that like, subscribe, bell notification, all that YouTube stuff. And until next time. Adios. Peace.